Okay, so here's another tip. Even though we do work on neoprene, everywhere is neoprene, so that things like this don't get scratched when you have to turn them face down. I go even further and I use like a little um, rice filled satin kind of bag. It's like for your mouse rest or your wrist rest or whatever. Um, and they make for great little balancing things because it's going to keep it more level. Um, but the other reason why I love using um, stuff like this is, um, is that it just gives a nice cushion to hold my items. And then I can go in and do my detailing with my e-file. So I'm going to be adding stones all down the side, but then I'm going to be going a lot smaller, so to sand and to prep these the best way, I'm going to use my little e-file, and I've got a little tiny mark right here, a little sharpie point that I'm going to get very thin with the SS3s right here, and some, like, some sixes, so just very, very small sanding is going to help that adhesion to give you a little bit more surface area. I'm going to have all of this area done. I've already done a dry fit uh, with my stones to see where they're going to lay out. So always do a little dry fit to practice before you start gluing in and, and before you start sanding or filing or buffing. But just this little bit is going to help give it a little bit more surface area for that glue to stick to give it strength for your customer, for your products to last a little bit longer. And then be careful when you're cleaning this, you don't want to rub the sanding debris um, onto the lenses and um, or even get them on your desk area. So now after I sand a couple of these, then I'm going to clean the whole area, alcohol everything off and not get any of this debris on this desk so that if this gets laid flat down again, it's not going to scratch. So be careful of everything that you're touching when you're doing stuff like this because it can go wrong so quickly um, and then you own a pair of glasses that maybe um, you didn't intend to own or lots of lots and lots of pairs so be very careful when you're sanding but definitely please try to sand when you need to all right hope this helps bye you guys